Alright, hello, welcome back to Diddy Kong Racing, with yours truly, Star Kron. Um, let's, let's head on into Snowball Valley, and uh, get it underway. See if I can do uh, a bit better than the last episode. Um, well, I was not doing too well in the last race, if I remember right. I think I only managed to come in first after, like, what, three laps or something? On the third lap, I managed to catch up or something. Yeah, it looks like I'm not doing too much better this time, but, you know, we'll see how it goes. Oh, okay. Try and get some of those boosts there. Let's catch up to Diddy. Why is it always Diddy who's in first? I think he's cheating. I think it's just because he has his own game, he can cheat and do whatever he wants. Oh, that was a beautiful missile shot. That was quite nice. Um, yeah. This, this, oh. Alright. Apparently someone wants me dead, I don't know who shot that missile at me. Oh god. Oh no, I hear a, uh, electric shield. I <laughs> hope that doesn't hit me. Um, alright, there we go, final lap. Things are not going too badly, actually. It's a bit of a rocky start, but we'll get this done. Drop down here. Very nice. Try not to miss the, the boost. Alright, look over these giant snowman heads. They're just jumping out of nowhere. There must be something propelling those things, because I don't think snowman heads can just jump by themselves normally. I don't know. Um, yeah, so that's that race done. And we got something else to collect from in there, however. Oh yeah, we got the, the big boss door opening up. Um, let's not do that just yet. Let's go grab. Let's go grab something real quick. Then we can go do the boss. Oh, oh god! I know we got the climatic boss music all playing and stuff, but we're gonna head back into Snowball Valley really quick here, just uh, to open up the bonus stage for this world. This is only gonna take two seconds. It's not. Too well hidden. It's actually just over here. You just turn left, and they got this little uh, spot for it right here. Let's just pick that up, and uh, yeah, we can head back to the lobby now. That'll open up the bonus stage. I guess we'll do that after the boss, if there's time. I'm sure, there should be. The boss is kind of a pushover, I think. Giant like walrus or something. Well, kind of spoiled it for whoever hasn't seen this game before, but you know. We we'll go in and do it anyways. I get to see him uh, in person. And, uh, oh, there he is. Well done. Thank you. Now I challenge you to race. Really? Um, you're a giant walrus. Are you sure you're up to it? I don't know. I guess we'll see how he does. Look, he's got his own statue of himself here. I don't know how many people he had to pay off to get that built. I know I would voluntarily build a statue of this guy. Get out of the way! Oh man. This guy is just not being cooperative. Alright, and I think this is the first time we've actually used the, the hovercraft in this let's play. Which is kind of awkward. I mean, it is. It's not anything to do with water. I don't know why you'd be hovercrafting down a, a giant mountain. You know, this would actually be pretty fun to do in, uh, in real life, you know, going down a giant mountain in a, a hovercraft. I wish I could do this. It looks pretty fun. But, um. Let's just go down here. Now look at those big candy canes. Very Christmas-like. Kind of appropriate for the season, I guess. And, uh... Yeah, let's just keep bouncing along here. I love bouncing the hovercrafts. Just... Oh god. I don't love crashing into trees or whatever. But yeah, uh, pretty easy race. Walrus is way too fat. He needs to lose weight before he challenges us again. Um... I think he'll pop up here now. Yeah, there he is. Oh, thank you. Try my new challenge. No, I don't want to. Oh, I, I don't want to. No. I don't want to see you. I already beat you. Go away. Leave me alone. Oh no, it's the genie. Take your finger off the... Ex yeah, we, I already know, genie. Go away. Alright. Uh, boss is done. We can now head over to the bonus stage. How convenient. Yes, let's head on in here. Finish this off. Icicle Pyramid. Icicle Pyramid. This is basically just like a, a Mario Kart battle ripoff. But, uh, uh... You can start off by hitting the person across from you if you just drive into the balloon. 
shoot him real quick. Oh uh, yeah, this is one of my favorite bonus stages, I think. It's, uh, I like it more than the, uh, the nesting, egg-stealing thing one. Whatever that one was. I don't know what it's called. But yeah, so we just drive around and shoot missiles at people, pretty much. And, um, try not to get shot ourselves. Uh, grab another missile. Here's a banjo over there. Go nail his ass. Very nice. Now one thing you can do for this minigame is just drive around up top and whenever someone decides to show their face, like Diddy here, you just shoot him in the ass. And, uh, there goes Diddy. Pretty easy. Oh. Seal the balloon from Timber. And, oh no. That was a terrible turn. Well, we're on the bottom floor now. Have to make our way back up since I think, uh, that's where the last couple dudes are at. Try not to hit the mines if at all possible. Because those take away uh, a hit from you. Hit Banjo. Banjo's out. So he's got Timber to deal with now. I think he's down on the bottom floor. You can kind of tell by, uh, well, obviously using the radar, but uh, depending on how big the little icon things are, it kind of determines what level they're on, I think. Oh, there he is. Let's go hunt him down. Screw save the tiger campaign. I'm gonna hunt you anyways. Yeah. Oh. I thought that was going to hit him for a second. Anyways, uh, there's that bonus done. What do we got here? We got like three minutes left or so. Oh, look at that. Another uh, useless piece of TT amulet. Guess we can sell that on Antiques Roadshow or something. Great. Alright. Let's uh, continue. Yeah, after a kind of long load. Let's just head out here. I think the genie is going to challenge us again when we go out here. He was pissed off that I didn't value his advice that he gave to me. Yeah, there he is. Right on cue. I think he comes out, like, after every boss battle or something. But, uh, hopefully we won't have to deal with him anymore once we're done uh, his first three races. And, oh, jeez. Yeah. I remember the first time I did this race, just, I had no idea where to go. You had to go through that waterfall. It's kind of out of the way. But, um, yeah, here we go. Bouncing around in the hovercraft. Very fun. We're actually using it in the water like it's supposed to be used this time. Um, go up here. Quite honestly, I don't know why you would ever want to really use the car. I mean, I guess it's a little bit faster on land. But, you know, most levels hovercraft is the way to go. But, you know, even on top of that, why would you ever use anything besides a plane in this game? I mean, the plane is clearly superior. You can just fly over all the crappy ass terrain and stuff. Anyways, let just go down here. And that genie is way behind. Maybe I should stop and let him catch up. What do you guys think? Should I, I'm gonna stop and let him catch up. Just I'll give him a little I'll give him a break. He's he's fat. He needs a needs to work on his racing skills definitely. Anyways there we go. You know I gave him a bit of a chance there. Actually I don't know if he cheats or something. Maybe he's not even going the same way I am. I've never actually taken the time to find out which route this guy takes when he does this race, but whatever, we're almost done. Do, do, do. Let's take the scenic route, let's go around here, see what's over here. Why not? I mean, oh! Wow. Fantastic. Apparently the genie <laughs> just made up a random excuse and is not going to let us win the race. What an asshole. Well, I'll be right back. Man, you just you try to be nice to a guy and give him a chance to catch up, and he rewards you by saying you're disqualified just by taking the scenic route. Alright, whatever. What's up, Genie? Yeah, you're, um... Yeah, friend? You might want to rethink that catchphrase. I don't think uh, we're going to be buds anymore after uh, what you just pulled. Anyways, guys, uh, I think that'll do it for this episode. Um, yeah, I'll see you all next time. Thanks for joining me. Peace out.